And I think uh, we're moving from an era of serendipity where drugs were given on a very ad hoc sort of basis to one where they're targeted at particular cells and molecules because we know those cells and molecules are actually involved in the, the development of lupus. So it makes a lot more sense immunologically. So I am hopeful that with better trial design and bearing in mind the individual nature of particular patients' problems and circumstances, uh, in the next 10 or 15 years we'll continue to see an improvement in the overall outcome for lupus patients, not just in terms of survival but also in terms of quality of life. Well, I think that um, the, the big challenge in lupus over the next 10 years is to develop a so-called stratified or personalised approach to treatment. Um, there are a lot of different medications that patients need to control various aspects of their disease. And I think that using biology to help us personalise the treatments better is really the big challenge for the next decade. I think it's a tough road to develop lupus treatments but there's certainly a lot of interesting biologies out there and targeted therapies out there, and we just need to move forward and learn how to design trials, interpret data. I think we need uh, drugs that are less toxic, uh, that prevent damage in our patients, and um, therefore we hope we get more new drugs, and now we have a new drug, and with this new drug we have to see how to handle that, which are the best patients that will get uh, the best chance out of it.